This is Zan. Zan is an office worker somewhere between the ages of 30 and 34. Looks like she just missed her bus for her 9 to 5 job in the CBD area. At the bus stop, it's squeezy, hot and sweaty. Zan is super uncomfortable, but there's nothing else she can do. Even after getting off the bus, she has to walk a really, really far way to get to her cubicle. And I mean really, really far. Zan's transport sucks. How can we make it better? Should she cycle? Buy a car? Take a grab? All these options are too tiring or troublesome or just plain expensive to be viable in the long run. Well then, how on earth can we make her commute better? Well, we have just the thing for Zan. Introducing Telepod, her way to a classy and convenient commute. With Telepod, Zan can have a stress-free and sweat-free ride to and from her office without ruining her makeup. To get the sales we need, here is a breakdown of our projected numbers. At the awareness stage, we want to hit 80% of our target audience, with 105,000 people reached. At the interest stage, we want to reach 40% of those who were reached at the awareness stage, at just over 50,600 members. At the desire stage, we are again looking at reaching 40% of all consumers who were interested, with our total number being around 20,200 consumers. Finally, for our action stage, we only need just under 10% of all consumers who desired to buy a scooter to actually make a purchase, bringing our final number to 2,005 scooters actually purchased for a total $1 million in profit. Our target market is huge, with over 132,000 working adults who do not have access to cars and trouble-free ways of getting to work every single day. Now, how are we going to reach such a big number of people? Well, I'm glad you asked. Outdoor advertisements, probably the most straightforward way of reaching our target audience. We intend to place ads both in the trains and in train stations so that people like Zan will be able to see them wherever they go on their morning commute. We've also got print covered. We'll place ads in both newspapers and magazines to reach members of our target audience regardless of what they're interested in. Our target audience are also heavy consumers of digital media, both outside of work and during work hours. This allows us to continually advertise to them even while they're at work, something else that none of the other platforms can do quite as well. We'll advertise on social media channels, YouTube, LinkedIn, and even Spotify to make sure that regardless of what apps they use, they'll get our message one way or another. And let's not forget about radio. Class 95 is one of Singapore's top English radio stations, making it the ideal platform to reach many of our target audiences who still tune in every day. Now that we know where our ads are going to be, let's talk about when they're going to be shown. Phase 1. It's the start of the new year. Ads during this period take advantage of the lack of advertising from other competitors to establish top-of-mind brand awareness in the mind of the consumer, establishing Teleport as the go-to brand for e-speakers for any of our target audience. Phase 2. It's the middle of the year and temperatures are slowly starting to increase. Our target audience will already be aware of Teleport at this point in time, so there's no need to remind them all that much. However, just in case, we'll continue to advertise just a little bit. Phase 3. It's the end of the year, which also means it's time for our target audience to get their end of year bonuses. With their greater disposable income, it's now time for us to convince them to make the buy. After a year's worth of hard work, they deserve it. It's time to treat themselves. After all, it is Christmas and everyone loves a good present. What better present than a Teleport e-scooter? With her very own Teleport e-scooter, Zan's hot, sweaty commutes will no longer trouble her ever again. <laughs>